papi boy donde quiero con cualquiera donde sea papi boy donde quiero con cualquiera donde sea papi boy donde con cualquiera donde sea papi boy inspires from the Travis Scott I uh, feel like this is the fan favorite so far. Is it? Yeah. yeah. I mean, everybody went crazy when when they saw them. Uh, you know, you get everybody hollering yeah. at you from the stands. Like, <laughs> it's just unique, and uh, you know, shout out Travis. Uh, but this is fire. What up guys, I'm Fernando Tis Jr. and we're about to go on locker tour. So let's start uh, with the Dior's. Inspires in Dior's, yeah, like, I mean, that's crazy. So fire. <laughs> with the logo on the back. What, what, so what's the logo here? Is this a new one for you? Yeah, it's a new logo. We came out with FTJ. Um, it stands out a little bit, uh, uh, just of myself, uh, my dad, you know, what, what that legacy is coming from. Um, I like it. Yeah, number 23. It has so, to be in there. Of course. <laughs> Why number 23? What, what made you choose number 23? Uh, it's just always a number that I saw my, most of my memories of my dad playing are with that number. Um, the serious number in my hometown is 23. And uh, I just fell in love with a kid with 23. So I feel like it was meant to be. No MJ, LeBron? Uh, I, I learned that a little bit more when I, you know, when I grew older, uh, know a little bit more about history and the game. But yeah, of course, I mean, those are great. Those are goats. So if you want to be up there, you got to be up there with those two. Sick. <laughs> and the Dior, like, is that that's a off the field brand, right? Yeah, like, I haven't seen that on a cleat brand, before. Off the field brand. We're trying to bring a little bit more swaggy, and uh, you know, trying to be unique and trying to go something different. You were successful with those. So what's next? <laughs> Looks like you got a whole stable. Uh, yeah. Uh, I'm going to go with this. The off-white, inspired off-white. Oh, fire. I haven't seen these yet. I already wear them, uh, I think, against the Dodgers. Uh, June uh, 23, San Pedro Macorís. That's my hometown, 1999. The cool. year I was born. Cool. Do you, do you know who customized these for you? Uh... My boy Nick uh, has the idea. I don't know who he's working uh, right now to make this happen, but my boy Nick uh, from Example. Um, right, right. Example. Okay. Yeah, he's doing. Uh, he's bringing all those those crazy ideas. Cool. Um, let's go. The pink ones. Uh, first, I started my first started my first game with this ones. Um, with the pink. I just love pink, you, you know, my favorite color goes, my mom's favorite color too. It's your favorite color? Yeah. Oh, so those, uh, those City Connect uniforms. Yeah. I mean, you know, those must be, <laughs> those yeah, are like, fire. They, yeah. They're growing on me. Yeah, they're really fire. Um, same, uh, we go with the, with the same, uh, with the logo and the number on the back yep. again. And, uh, you know. Sick. So what about those Jordan 1s? Like, why, why have you decided that was the... The silhouette uh, you wanted to do, and I play, I played uh, all my years. Like I played with Under Armour uh, most of my career. I played with Adidas, so I never wear Nike. So I'm trying to go try Nike this year. Didn't want to go too basic uh, with the Harachis, uh, right. so I decided to go, you know, Jordans and some customized uh, just to have fun with it. That's a great. It's a great palette. Like it's a great. <laughs> Clean slate, you can do a lot with it. So you, the, like I see these Travis Scotts yeah. here too. I gotta get a close wanna, look at those. I wanna, I wanna take this a little bit more, but obviously inspires from the Travis Scott. Uh, feel like this is the fan favorite so far. Is it? Yeah, yeah. I mean, everybody went crazy when, when they saw them. Uh, you know. You get everybody hollering yeah. at you from the stands like. <laughs> it's just unique and uh, you know, shout out Travis, uh, but this are fire. Do you guys go to Houston this year? Uh, I don't. I think so. Cause he's he's all about the yeah. Astros, so maybe you'll run into him. <laughs> maybe, I'm sure maybe. he'll appreciate those. Yeah, maybe I will pull those uh, when when I when I'm out there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, what else we got? Those uh, are those like just regular shoes? Those like mint with blue? Those yeah. those are sick. Yeah. yeah, I like those a lot. Yeah, I really send them to me. Do you do you just take practice. BP in those? Yeah, take BP. You know, you have some swag out there. Sick. <laughs> the Jordan 1 is maybe the best shoe 
in my like in my opinion ever. Like it's just so it's so classic. Yeah. It's iconic. Yeah. Um, it's definitely iconic. Any any other uh, cleats you got, or or you want to move uh, on maybe to the bats? I haven't used this ones, but oh, I'm waiting uh, for the right moment once to take them out. But the fours, yeah. M fours over the logo. I like that. I like that. Obviously, that's what the brown. I mean, the brown uni is gonna. Yeah, it's like we go to the browns. So I feel like they Sick. can go with any uniform over here. Another classic. Another classic, but you know, I got way more surprises. Uh, but you know, I won't take them, all of them out just at the same time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll take my you got to leave a little bit to the yeah, imagination exactly. to keep people coming back. Exactly. So. Um, all right. What about the the bats? What do you got for bats? Uh, Victus. Uh, Why Victus? I use Victus since the beginning of my career. I mean, since Doughboy started using them. Uh, probably the best wood in the game for me and uh, you know they always have shown me love and treat me the right way so shout out to Victus uh, with my lizard skin I'm a big lizard skin guy used to be more comfortable yeah uh, with my grip what, what's uh, the model uh, I created my own model uh, my first year on the show FC 23 it was a combination like from I2T and C271 Oh, uh, okay. kind of a combo of yeah, like a balanced and a, and a end loaded bat. So yeah, exactly. So try to modify it to myself uh, to feel great, and uh, it has worked so far. So why change it? I wouldn't change it. <laughs> um, yeah. So and it's uh, let's see, 33 and a half, 31. Mm -hmm. Is that every time? You don't like? Doesn't matter what pitcher you're gonna uh, go 33 and a half, 31. I sometimes change to 34. Right now, I'm at 33 and a half this year, uh, but when I'm feeling strong, I, I sometimes I change to 34. 34, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, and it's a uh, maple, yeah. not not birch. I see a lot uh, of guys maple. swinging birch. Uh, I'm more of a maple guy. Uh, not I tried birch before. Have nothing against it, but really, just not my favorite. I hear you. Mm, All right, up. and then uh, your glove. So, I've been using this penguin uh, most of the time. Just like I mentioned earlier, my, my mom and I have a favorite color uh, with her name on the front. Beautiful. 23, uh, logo inside, it's kind of fading a, a little bit. I like that though, I like it fading <laughs> like that. Yeah. It's got some nice use yeah, to it. Yeah, some really nice use and uh, yeah, very detailed, Psalm 23-1. What's that? It's just uh, a song from the Bible, just to keep protection of myself. Do you know uh, what's the what is that? Uh, I don't know how to say it in English, but more, uh, in Spanish. say it in Spanish. No te vayas al valle de la sombra de la muerte. It's like walking through the shadow, valley of shadow of death. I know. Yeah, it's a, an entire. I just got one, but it's the entire verse. I got that you. I really like. And then the the model. What's the model on the on that? Pro three o three, twelve and three quarters. Yeah. What's been the? That's the classic. So what's been the hardest transition for to go from infield to outfield? Um, just stay focused on for me. I feel like, you know, I'm just a great athlete all the way around. So I'm really not afraid where I'm playing on the field. It's just more of myself. If I will stay locked in out there. And, uh, you know, I, I definitely am and I'm having fun and, you know, definitely looking forward to this new challenge. Yeah, I mean, it's it's a matter of time before we get the poster of you jumping four feet in the air to rob a home run. <laughs> Have you robbed one yet? No, not yet. It's coming, man. Yeah, it's, but it's definitely coming. I'm I, looking forward to I that. I feel like I have those hops. With the hair in the back, too? Yeah. Like, it's just gonna, that's going to be a poster. <laughs> so, different color, um, same model. You were gaming this one early in the year. Yeah, I started with this one, um, El Nino. Kind of balanced more when we play with the Army uniform and... Uh, I bring the black out and, uh, you know, just feel really comfortable with this too so far. And you go through uh, two in the pinky, it looks like, too. You got yeah, two I'm, in the... Yeah, I'm trying to go two Somebody in the teach pinky. you that, or...? Yeah, uh, they taught me that. Uh, actually, since I was a kid, more it was like outfielders go more two in the pinky. When I was playing the infield, I used to go more straight forward. Yeah. But I kind of learned how to go two in the pinky, and I like it so far. Yeah, it's it's about catching the ball out there, right? Yeah. So like you're not so worried about the feel. Like you just want to make sure exactly. you can you could close the glove around it. Mm -hmm. um, so like for Rawlings, any particular reason you like Rawlings? You chose Rawlings? I mean, they've always been great. 
you know, since the beginning. And, uh, you know, I was working with Ms. Uno um, earlier um, in my career, but I feel like it was they were really good. Um, but, you know, um, Rawlings just, I decided to go with Rawlings this year. Yeah. Just to try something new, something different. And, you know, they have been one of the greatest of all time. You would even change in the infield, like you would change gloves. I would see that you'd wear the, the camel one, you'd wear black another mm -hmm. day. Like you, you don't get attached to one glove. You don't. Um, I feel like I prepare them enough, um, you know. To I don't get really get attached just to one. Uh, I'm open to change. I really don't. I'm not that. How do you call it? Um, like optimistic or yeah superstitious yeah, superstitious yeah uh with the gloves so you know whatever i'm feeling that day i just go out and show it how about the inside of that one is that have the same logo on yeah, it same oh okay logo. cool it's got the imprint yeah the same model sick i like that one a lot <laughs> uh so we got bat glove cleats how about batting gloves i saw you got some new lizard skin stuff using lizard skin and, uh, and nike um so far which nike. has been better so far oof they're both good, you know. Probably the good part is not having a contract so far. You can, you can use whatever <laughs> you, you want. You can use whatever you want. I but, know it's kind of nice. Uh, you know, just going with the feel. I feel like Lizard Skin have given more options with colors, uh, more var variety, and uh, they're super comfortable too. Uh, I have no complaints. The uh, inside is it like leather, like standard leather, like a traditional batting glove? Because yeah. the outside's so different. Yeah. Like it's it's like a uh, yeah it's knit. traditional leather uh, leather, and it feels really good actually. Oh, and you even got the logo yeah, on Yeah, I got the logo on oh, there, sick. too. That's sick. Really nice. Um, so you got your batting gloves, cleats, bat, glove. You got the sleeve. I saw the sleeve. The sleeve. You've been wearing this pink sleeve. How about what do you? Wh why do you wear the sleeve? Like, what's the? Is there? Is it just for the look or? Uh, for the look, and I'll show like how it feels. Lizard skin. This is one of the best I have ever arm sleeves I ever wore. Um, oh really? Before. Yeah, they fit perfect to your arm, and uh, they can they keep it nice and tight. Uh, you like it tight? Yeah, yeah, for the game. Yeah. For the compression. Yeah, for the compression, stay warm, nice and loose, and. Uh, you know, they're really, really comfortable. I think you need to get a mint colored one too. Oh, the yeah. logo looks great there. Yeah, yeah, that's mint. Um, that's a great, that's a great idea. Yeah, because I saw you with the City Connect. Felt like the, the, the lizard skin batting gloves, the mint batting gloves mm -hmm. would look so good with the yeah. mint sleeve. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Um, all right, is that anything else that, uh, that we missed? Of course. How could I forget? <laughs> you you actually like they these guys popped off when you wore them like I guess it, you weren't the first but you kind of pushed them into yes. a, into a new level. Yes. So who's who is this brand here? Definitely 100%. Um, they're based here from San Diego. I mean, we started working about it was my second year in the big leagues and uh, it has been game changer uh, since that. So you got my logo print on there. Actually, this is my second model. Uh, it hasn't come out. Uh, I got your first model, by the yeah, way. Yeah, it's about to come <laughs> out, this this one, and, uh, you know, super fire. They f they're so comfortable. They fit just perfect. The the lenses pop out the colors like crazy, so it's and just an amazing glasses. I was talking around. to Trey Turner. He was saying, like, the, the visibility is so good with yes. them, too. Like, yes, like I said, they pop out the colors. Uh, they turn out the brightness, but they don't go dark. It's like they fit. They just go perfect with it. They're yeah. the best. They're the best in the game. I love right. wearing those 100% uh, for for baseball. Yeah, they're really nice, and they're cycling. Like they came from a, like a cycling yeah. background. Um, all right, is that is that it anymore? Oh, okay. good. I think that's about it. Yeah. So maybe I got a fan question from way back. It's my favorite question to ask. <laughs> it's. Fast, your fast food order. So, like, you go to the fast food restaurant. Like, what are you getting? What, what restaurant and what are you getting? Fast food. Yeah. Oh, the only, it could be in Dominican as well. Yeah, the only, uh, well, the fast food here in the state that I actually only eat is a Chick Fil A. Oh hell yeah. Yeah. So. What would you get? Uh, actually, uh, Chick Fil A Deluxe um, and uh, Chick Fil A sauce. Yeah. How, how about in uh, Dominican? Uh, pica pollo. 
uh, that's the chicken they make on the street. Uh, they're the best. Say, thanks for that. I appreciate you, man.